Set now for the bottom of the fifth. And next will be the imposing power back, Matt Olson. And a fastball misses here to start the at bat. It's 1 0. And he grooves the fastball there. This is hit high and deep out to straightaway center field. And oh, he missed a home run by a matter of feet. It's off the wall. And he is in to third with a leadoff triple. Here's the second baseman, the second D.J. LeMayhew, as the first pitch to him is off the plate for a ball 1-0. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. And that's too high, ball 2. 2-1. Two two three and one. Team's been struggling on offense. Let your D work for you right here. Pound the zone. Skied into very shallow right. Chu has it, and I'd be surprised if they send the runner. And they will not try running on that arm. Wisely so, as he holds on tight with one away now. Here comes the first pitch. Fastball just misses. That's ball one. One out and a runner on third. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. Great situation to be up at the plate right now. But if you're on the mound, there is absolutely no reason to give in to him. Stay on the outer quadrants of the plate and don't get beat in the middle. Three and one to him now. Has a look, now the pitch. Checked his swing there, and did he go? No, he did not, says the third base umpire. So it's ball four. Now with the plate, Yosemite Grandal. So far, 0 for 1 with a flyout. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Props to the hitter right there for laying off with a guy on third. You want to be aggressive, but you have to get a pitch you can drive. 2 0 now. Right side, hit hard. And that'll get on through into right field for a base hit. And they're on the board as this is now a 3 1 ball game. Justin Turner will get the call to pinch hit here, and he'll find he has a couple of runners aboard with only one out in the inning. And now we'll take a moment here at home plate as he asks for time. Good slider there, and he gets ahead of him, nothing in one. Quite an interesting outing up to this point as we head into the middle innings. He's pitching quite well. And this will be just what the manager ordered as he's off the bench with extra bases. Now batting, number 27. Lee Smith is going to have his work cut out for him here. Two runners in scoring position, so he'll try to leave them right where they are. Into the box now, Adalberto Mondesi. As the first pitch here is a bit high, it's ball one. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. On a line, that's a base hit. And not in time as the run scores. Now the throw comes in to hold that second runner at third, so they're at the corners now with still only one away. And that misses for ball one. He's hitless in his two at-bats so far. A ball and a strike. This is skied into short left center. Soto has it, and I'd be surprised if they send the runner. And even with two away now, that ball just didn't get out there deep enough, so they'll hold him at third base. Ready for another shot now, Christian Yelich. And we'll see what he can do here with a pair of runners on base and two gone here in the fifth. 
good fastball there. Didn't get the swing, but the guy at the plate isn't someone who chases many bad pitches. Hard hit ball towards the hole. And a backhanded reach at first, but he can't flag it down. And the runner from third crosses the plate. It's a 4-3 to three game. At the plate now, Eugenio Suarez. As the first pitch to him is swung on and missed for strike one. 0 for 2 for him to this point. 0 and 2 the count to Suarez. Sometimes you can get away with a pitch in that location when you're running it. There's a swing and a ball hit in the air and a ball that he got every stitch of as that one without a doubt is gone. 